Hello guys and welcome to another exciting episode of Style 101. I'm your host Idia Aysen and today we'll be checking out must see looks from the BAFTA Awards followed by some hot spanking trends that you don't want to miss and last but not least we will check out Balenciaga and Yeezy's 2018 spring campaigns. Is high fashion becoming too approachable? Joining me today is Tenny Zakios, Jameson brand ambassador and co-founder of Native Magazine. Welcome to the show. Hey, what's up, Idia? What's going on? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. Feeling good. <laughs> good to see you. And also, I have the gorgeous Soliat Bada, who is one third of the CEO dancers and the head chef at Nula's Kitchen. Yes. Welcome to the show. Hi. Thank you for having me. Thank you for being here. Last but not least, I have the hot. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do this. <laughs> Ex Big Brother Nigeria, Basi. Ekbeyong, who is also a musician, mm. actor, and an MC. Yeah. How are you? I'm very, I'm very great. Nice to be here, man. Nice to be here. Okay, okay. So I know you just dropped a single. Tell us about that. Um, single Repay dropped uh, a couple of days ago. What did you say? Repay. Repay. It's titled okay. Repay, and it's across platforms on um, on the internet. So just go to my link on, on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook, click on it, and get Repay banging on your airwaves. Ooh, I can't wait to hear it. <laughs> We're going to turn up to this song, right? Yeah, already. For sure. <laughs> For sure. Okay. <laughs> So, Soliat, can you tell us how you transitioned from dancing mm -hmm. to founding Nula's Kitchen? Um, so, I've been dancing for 10 years. I've been a professional dancer for 10 years. And I just thought that it's time to kind of start... Diversifying. Vis yeah, visiting other creative passions of mine. And cooking was definitely something that I was always fond of. So, I just decided to start my culinary journey. Okay, so what kind of food should we expect from Nula's Kitchen? Is it Oriental? Is it African? What is it? It's very African influence. So, Ooh. it's a bit of everything, but with an African undertone. Oh, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> 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 okay, so Tenny, can you tell us about Native Magazine? Yeah, so Native Magazine is a platform for young Africans all over the world is usually for millennials just to inspire like the youth to know that they have the chance to do something great for Nigeria so we, we represent the whole of Africa the whole black community and anyone who's youthful doing something great for their country hmm. yeah. okay so guys the British Academy of Film and Television Arts was a highly star-studded event as we know it's an award show to honor British and international contributions to film. So are you guys ready to see some of the yeah. looks from the red carpet? <laughs> First off, we have Octavia Spencer. What do you think about her dress? Mm. Starting with you, Sulia. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, it's pretty. I just think, obviously, she's an older woman. She's mm -hmm. more mature. Mm -hmm. So I think it suits her age. And she looks beautiful, I think. Okay. Yeah. Teddy. I think she looks good. I think it looks really nice on her. Uh, I like the sequence beads. Mm -hmm. The makeup is subtle. She looks mature. It looks. It fits her. Fits her size. Fits her look. Yeah, nice. Okay, Basi. Well, um, I particularly, I'm in love with the shade. It's it's black, and I love black, and uh, I love the the details on on the dress. I think it's I think it's really beautiful. You can't go wrong with black, basically. So yeah, I'd, I'd love to buy that for for someone. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, <laughs> can you tell us who? My mom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, fair enough. And to you guys back home for watching, we've had such an amazing show. The BAFTA Awards, <laughs> must see looks, you know, the trends, Ebukaz Agbada, and now, you know, just talking about Yeezys and Balenciaga. So, yes, yeah, so our one-on-one stays cool, guys. Join us again next time on the show. Mwah. <laughs>